This video will guide you through a step-by-step -step calibration process with Spyda 5 that gives you exceptional color accuracy for image display and printing. Before we start with the calibration process, download the software at goto.datacolor.com slash get 5 Enter your serial number that is located in the box under the Spyda 5 sensor. Plug your Spyda 5 into a USB port on your computer. Make sure it is a direct port with adequate power after you've installed the Spider 5 software, the welcome screen will show you the four necessary steps to ensure an accurate calibration. Click Next once you have performed these preliminary steps. Step 1. Select the display type. Here, you will choose whether you are using a desktop or a laptop display. Then, click Next. Step 2. Display model. Choose the manufacturer and model of your display. If unavailable, Choose the model which is similar to yours. Step 3. Sensor Placement The Spider 5 device has four parts. The Auto Ambient Light Sensor, Display Sensor, Lens Cap and USB. Remove the lens cap of the display sensor. It is used as a counterweight so that the unit remains in place and flat against the screen. We recommend that you slightly tilt your display back so the unit rests against the monitor without you having to hold it in place, as any movement can cause a poor calibration. Once the unit is in place, click the next button to proceed with the calibration. A series of color patches will flash on the screen. This process takes approximately 5 to 6 minutes. Once completed, click on the finish button to proceed. Step 4. Profile and Comparison After the calibration is complete, save the calibration profile. You may rename it or accept the given profile name. You can also set a reminder of when to recalibrate your display. We recommend a minimum of once a month. Click Save to proceed. The Spider-Proof window will appear. It allows you to compare between your new calibrated and old uncalibrated image by clicking on the switch button. Click on the thumbnail to zoom in and see the changes. You will see here the impact of calibration from color, highlight and shadow details. You're now done. Click on Quit to exit the software or choose Calibrate another display if you have another monitor connected to this computer that you want to calibrate. Congratulations! You have now completed your first monitor calibration. Your computer now uses the new monitor profile. Experience the true color in your images with Data Color Spider Photo and Design Tools. For more information, visit www.datacolor.com or follow us on all our social media accounts.